everybody, this is my Barbie look. I'm going to see the Barbie movie today. I'm so excited. And yeah, I've been literally dreaming of this since they announced the movie. And yeah, I'm just going to have a perfect Barbie day. And this is my look. And I'll show you through the mirror. Maybe you can see better. I got this Barbie t-shirt. I should have got a size bigger, but I didn't know they ran um, small. So this is an extra large. And I still think it runs pretty tight slash small, but whatever. And then I'm wearing um, jean shorts. It's kind of hard to see. And then I brought my Barbie purse with me. And I got her from Target. Target. Um, I can't tell if you can tell in this video, but it's like a hot pink. So it's really cute. And I also got this t-shirt from Target. So yeah, we love Target. <laughs> if you hear background noise, it's just my husband eating and packing and all that good stuff but anyways have you seen the barbie posters yes i made one for myself um yeah <laughs> they're really fun and cute on top they always say this barbie is whatever and so as you can see in the picture which i will post i did this barbie is a mood because i like to think i am a mood <laughs> and then if i was a barbie i would describe myself this barbie has chronic illness back problems depressed, anxious, but this Barbie is also obsessed with coffee, Disney, <laughs> pillow pets, and Barbie, of course. So yeah, I'm excited to once again see the movie. It looks super cute, and I'll let you guys know how I thought it was, and then we'll continue with my Barbie day. What I will do, what I think Barbie would want me to, or what I think she would want to do, so yeah, see you guys soon. Bye. All right, I just got done with the movie and I loved it. I thought it was really cool and really cute. And it even kind of goes into a little bit of history about Barbie. So I really thought that was cool. I was not expecting that because, you know, it's not documentary or anything like that. But I really enjoyed it a lot. And now I'm going to go to Starbucks because I feel like Barbie would want me to treat myself to some coffee and then oh I was thinking during the movie what kind of Barbie would you be comment down below all right uh, time to get coffee and then I'll be on my way home and we'll see what else is up for us I just got my coffee my favorite is the salted caramel cream cold brew um, during the summers it's delicious and so good and look how pretty she is I love her all right, on my way home now. I'm finally home. I got lost a little bit, but we did it. <laughs> um, so yeah, one of the big major news is that I actually moved and I love it. And it's a house house, not like an apartment. And I feel very grateful. And I feel like I'm in my own Barbie dreamland home. So yeah, um, I did want to show you something that I did get. So some movie theaters had Barbie merch you can buy. Either a popcorn bucket, which was a convertible, like a toy car, but convertible and big enough where you can put popcorn inside. I wish we had that. It looked super cute, um, but we did have something small and something I haven't actually seen anyone else got. Floaty. So it's supposed to be a floaty for your drinks. And I love it. It's a pink flamingo and I'm going to keep it forever <laughs> for a little memory. And luckily this was cheaper than the convertible Barbie car if I did have an option, which sadly I did not. But I at least had this, which I'm feeling grateful. And I put my coffee in just to, you know, show and tell. <laughs> and then I have my Minnie Mouse. She went with me to see the movie. And then I did get a big fat popcorn bucket. Um, I did not eat all of it. <laughs> So then next time when we go to the movies, we just bring this bucket with and then we'll just pay $5 for the next refill, I think. That's how it works. It was expensive now, but it'll be worth it as we go to the movies more. And then my purse. She looks so cute. And now it's time to fill my water bottle, which I will show you. I'm going to fill it up. It's my pink Starbies because obviously pink Barbie and then pink's my favorite color anyways. But it's a nice tumbler, Starbucks tumbler. Um, in case you can't tell, I love Starbucks. <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna fill her up with water and then we're gonna watch YouTube. The funny thing is, my husband and I are actually really obsessed with the refrigerator. She's new 
and we love it. We never had water before on the refrigerator. So this was like something new for us. So when we first moved in, we were just like standing in awe and trying it out. So like ice, check. And it's really nice because it has the light too. Takes a while, but it's worth it. Look at that, so fun, right? <laughs> I'm watching an apartment tour on YouTube and it's fun, it's cute, it's fresh and something random but I've never had a TV on the wall before like in my room so that's really nice. I love it. I'm now going to read this book It Ends With Us by Colleen Hoover and I heard like everyone and their mother on YouTube talk about this book and how good it is and I heard it's like a basic girl book but I don't care. I love basic. This Barbie is basic and I'm proud of it. <laughs> um, so I'm excited to try it out. Hopefully it's good. Barbie would totally approve of me reading because she reads too. She does it all. And then I love this bookmark I have. The character is in Animal Crossing and I love it. It's just super cute. Him reading by the fire. Perfect. I love Animal Crossing. I love this bookmark a lot. It's super cute. And let's get started. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think this would be Barbie girl dinner. I feel like she would eat a lot better than this, but I'm tired and back is killing me. So I just microwaved soup. It's supposed to be like a sausage um, gumbo type thing. It's not bad. I like it. And then I'm watching YouTube on the phone. And yeah, yum yums. So I just finished my dinner, that's why <laughs> the table is pretty much empty. And I actually did get to finish my water, so that makes me very happy. So I wanted to show you an app I use to help keep track of how much water I'm intake. Because um, I want to try and prove my goal. It's called Water Llama. And right now I have this otter as my character. And as you reach goals and stuff, you get new characters to unlock, which is really fun. But I really like the otter because I think it's super cute. And then uh, since I drank my water, I add it and it's 24 ounces and it's really easy. And then it just, um, you set up a goal. So um, right now it says I'm 33% of my goal. So obviously I did not do good today because um, I know my second second one of this today i don't think i'm gonna finish it uh by the end of the day but i'm trying slowly but surely um, but i like it. it's a fun easy app and it's cute and then the water widget um it also like i was showing you earlier you can click on it to go into the app and then on your screen it will show you also your water intake which is really fun and then they also have an apple watch app so you can do it straight from your um, watch as well, which I do sometimes. So yeah. Oh yeah, I'm a book girly now, so I have Goodreads. I don't know what my name is on it. I'm trying to see. Elena with the unicorn emoji. So if you want to follow me on Goodreads. Hi Emma, I miss you. She's been hiding all day, but that's okay. Hi Emma. Hi Queen, I missed you. And this is my cane I've been using. I try to not use it too much because I don't want to depend on it. But her name is Stabelle <laughs> and she's been good to me because um, I have back issues. So it's easier to get in and out of chairs with my cane, Stabelle. And then there's Emma, my cat, doing kitty things. <laughs> and then yeah, like I said, find me on Goodreads if you have it. And we can become friends and you can stock what books I'm currently reading and what I want to read. Um, so yeah, fun funs. This product, I think Barbie herself would approve. And since I'm obviously a big fan of Disney, I had to get the Minnie Mouse version. It's from the brand PMD. I don't know what that stands for, but 
it's like this face cleanser thing. <laughs> That's my cat Emma, if you hear her. Then in the back, it has like a heating thing, so you can make it hot. And I don't know what that does exactly, but it feels nice. But yeah, this part, you put your um, face wash on it, and then it vibrates. And it can do different settings on your face. And then it helps you, supposed to help you wash your face better. I love her. It feels nice. And it's supposed to be cleaner because um, it's silicone, I think. Um, so it's supposed to be able to clean easier than those like hairbrush versions from a while ago. And then I use Youth to the People um, Kale, Green Tea, Spinach, Vitamins. That's all that's in the um, cleanser, which is really nice. So, because my face is really sensitive, so it's nice to have natural ingredients. And then this is super cute. Barbie would approve of this. I love Minnie Mouse and it's a soap dispenser. I love it. And I got my husband one and it's black. So, you know, manly and it's Mickey. So, <laughs> but I love it and it's hard to see, but there's little Mickey um, silhouettes. I don't know what it's called, but it's super cute. I love them. Mine has hearts. I love it, it's super cute. And then we have a watcher. There's Emma. She's just chilling with me. We like to hang out together. I know it's a bad view of me, but I wash, I put water on my face first and then I water the brush and then I add the face wash before I put it on my face. So I just put enough water on my face to just dampen it. And then I just do one squirt of the face wash. So nice. And now it's time for my face. So you just do that. And you go all over the face. The only awkward part is kind of like, if you need to narrow it, it's kind of hard to do. Like in the corners. But if you work it, it's nice. And see, you can see the soap on it. I might have not put enough water on my face. But it's working, I can tell. So yeah, and then you just um, wash your face with water. That's pretty much it. <laughs> I forgot to um, say what I thought about this. It's okay. I don't see what the hype is yet, but I've only read the first 100 pages, so it could pick up and be really good. I hope there's some kind of twist. I hope there's some kind of plot, like, you know. Um, so, so far, it's okay. I'm not mad about it. It's a nice, easy read, which I like. So, yeah, that's what I think about it. I read to page 100 so far, so yeah, I'll, I'll still give her a try and I'm excited to see where it goes hopefully. I'm so happy I got my Mickey ice cream bar. Barbie would totally approve. She's a little broken, but that's okay, aren't we all? But yeah, I'm excited. I love everything tastes better, Mickey shape. And also, it just reminds me of Disney World when I would eat Mickey ice cream bars. So, it's so nice we have it here at home as well. Obviously, they're a little different, but it makes me so happy still. Heating pad on for my back. And then I'm also going to play... Dreamlight Valley. It's my favorite game besides Animal Crossing while I watch um, Housewives. So yeah, it's a great night. Yes, I'm pretty sure Barbie would approve. <laughs>
Kenya claims that she's dating a new guy. Ain't nobody single though. Ah, not the never before seen boyfriend. <laughs> 